This is Dav. He's our executive producer, and so he's got a lot of time on his hands. We thought we'd give him a little something to do. This week on Dare Dav, we're doing the one thing that Dav has refused to do since day one. Dav's been a bit through the wars a little bit. Um, mm. He's got a bit of a scar on his head. Um, and he's been through like the ultimate dare dive, which is why there wasn't a dare dive last week. There was a faux dare dive in which I fell off a zip wire, so if you want to watch that, don't. But this week on dare dive, uh, I've got some uh, makeup things. That's a lot. See, that's, that's too many brushes for, for one small face. Oh, you said I've got a small face? <laughs> so we're going to do. Uh, do him up a little bit. I've got him a nice wig. I've got him some lashes. But to be fair, the wig's all right because I kind of need it. So. Oh. Do you feel ready to get started? No, I hate it. Like I genuinely <laughs> don't like it. You don't have a lot of eye space. This is an issue for me. You've got really nice tamed eyebrows though, but so that's nice. It's really itchy. <laughs> <laughs> have you just scratched your eyebrows? <laughs> Can you stop squinting your face? It's really inconvenient. I haven't done a lot to your eyebrows. You still okay. look like you for now. Good. Okay, but I'm. Not like looking like me. Does this not hurt you? No. Why is it hurting you? It feels like I'm just being jammed in the eye. Doing dare dab is giving me trust issues. Um, I'm gonna go in with an orangey shade. I'm gonna pop that in your crease. In my crease. Don't put it in my crease. We're not get it back out there. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Ow. What did? Why did that hurt? Did you, you open your eye? Yeah. <laughs> That's your own fault. Oh, glitter. <sighs> yes, glitter. It'll be on your face all day. Oh, I've got an itchy eyebrow. No, don't oh. itch your eyebrow. Oh, my whole face itches. No, it doesn't. It honestly does. It just... <laughs> you okay? Especially there. Are you okay? <laughs> You're my friend. I honestly wish I was back in hospital. <laughs> Dav, don't say that. Okay, you ready? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. How's that feel? It just feels like I'm being patted by a dog's nose. This is actually too light for you. Is it the fear? What What is it that makes you uncomfortable about it? Just this? the fact that it's not me. Should we make it a therapy session? <laughs> it's not. Stop squinting your face, otherwise it's going to crease and look ugly. Stop being dramatic. I'm dying. You're not dying. You've been through worse. I have, but I'd generally more enjoy enjoyable. Stop squinting your head, forehead, because you're going to make it creasy and gross. That's right, with my operation I had a, had a facelift, genuine. Yeah, you've also shifted to one side. I have, yeah, it? my head shifted to one side. Because <laughs> <laughs> they've taken part of my head out. Look up. Do not look down under any circumstances. Ah. Oh, your forehead's a creasy mess. That's not my fault, that's Dav's fault. It's because it's shifted. It's not, it's because you've got a creasy head. How do you, how, why have I got a creasy head then? Tell me. Because you've been moving it. Because I frowned a lot. Yeah. Genuinely, if someone said, would you rather jump out of a plane or would you like to put some makeup on? I'd rather jump out of a plane. Right, how'd you feel? Yep, yep. Still, still as awful as, as five minutes ago. But it looks really pretty. Exactly. Like you look really pretty. Do you not feel really pretty? No, not one bit. So would you say that you don't pay attention to someone's highlight then? No, 100%. Why? Someone might have worked really hard on their highlight. Yeah, but I'd rather them work hard on their conversation. Why do you wear makeup then? Why do I wear makeup? Yeah. I enjoy doing it. It's not even that I necessarily feel better about myself when I'm in it. Mm. Um, so not necessarily the outcome of it, but the process of putting on makeup yeah. you enjoy. Yeah, it's like an art form. You've literally got no face room at all. I think for boys you don't have the stress of having to to enhance the way you look as much. Okay. And if you do, like it is actually quite you just have to do exercise, I guess. And that's a lot cost the yeah, like it doesn't cost as much to do exercise. So you can do it anywhere whereas makeup actually costs quite a bit. It does, it is expensive. And I imagine the more you pay for it the better yeah. quality of stuff you get. So I'll just try and put it on gently. How's that? <laughs> How is it? I feel horrible. <laughs> Why? I feel dirty. This was your 
Why'd you feel dirty? I can't believe you're actually brushing my fake hair. <laughs> Gotta make sure that it looks nice. How'd you feel? I feel awful. But do you know what? You look really pretty. <laughs> I think at this point, I think it's time that you need to see yourself properly. Yeah, please. What? Actually ridiculous. So it's all gone? Yes. No more. I feel so much better now. <laughs> it's weird how differently you felt towards the end of that. Yeah, I felt so uncomfortable. It's, I don't know what it is, but I, I feel a lot more insecure wearing it than I do like no. this. So it's not even the feeling of it on the skin that makes you uncomfortable, although it, you did find that uncomfortable. Yeah, it was, it was, yeah, a little bit uncomfortable, but that was just itchy, but not the feeling of it. It's more the feeling that you have of not feeling 100%. Innocent. Yeah, I don't, feel, I don't feel like me wearing it, I, and when I see it like... I'm so comfortable in my own skin. Uh, I've, I've been very lucky that I know lots of people have insecurities about, about the skin they're in and, and about it, but I'm very lucky that I am so comfortable in, in my own skin that to change it feels strange. But that's the opposite for other people, yeah. for a lot of the opposite people. So I completely understand why they would feel secure in, in that sense, because that's genuinely one of the most insecure I've ever felt. Because it's just not me. And I think knowing that people feel like that without it... Yeah. That is. is shocking. That is really sad. Because I don't feel that way. I don't feel like without makeup on I am like nothing. But I know people out there that do feel like that. Mm -hmm. And that's really, really, really sad. But yeah, I, I hated it. But I can understand why people do it. Um, because... If it stops you from feeling the way I felt there, I like it was the if it was the other way around I would do it because it is a scary feeling and you feel really small. I felt I've never felt so small in in doing something like there's so many things I would do and I and I'd and I have done yeah and I have, and done, I, have done yeah and I, I wouldn't feel embarrassed and I wouldn't feel small doing it whereas that was a bit different. Did it like? make you nervous having it on? Yeah, no, completely. I, I felt like, because we have a few windows around here, I felt as soon as someone was near there, I just felt their eyes were beaming, like... And they weren't. At it, and they weren't. They weren't even looking in. Yeah, and I found that really horrible. Um, yeah. So, yeah, that's such a weird thought. Because I don't feel that yeah. in day-to-day -day life. Like, I'm quite oblivious yeah. to, to, to things. Um, and I can happily go about my day just not realise what people are doing or what they're looking at, what they're talking about. Um, whereas in that moment there, it felt like everything was just... On you? Yeah, oh, it was horrible. Did you yeah. feel paranoid as well about it? Yeah, genuinely. I, I genuinely feel paranoid. I, f I can't tell you how, how like, relieved. refreshed and relieved I am to, to be what I'd consider as myself. Yeah. Which is really nice.